if you are new here or welcome back if you have been here before. I am Freya and this is Budgie Budgets and today is Sunday so we are rounding out my bombardment of videos for the week <laughs> with our weekly check-in cash unstuffing from envelopes and budget with me. Um, look guys I put nails back on. I couldn't help myself. I couldn't help myself. Um, I ripped one of my nails down really, really low and it was so sore. And I was like, do you know what? If I put fake nails on top of that, that's going to keep it, keep it in place. So it can't get any worse. Um, so I've just decided that I am just going to wear the same kind of fake nails for like quite a while so that it doesn't freak blue bar out. I've changed them. She really didn't seem to mind this morning. I put them on last night. Um, and she was still happy to, to step up on my finger this morning and stuff. So it doesn't seem to have freaked her out too bad. Um, but yeah, I just miss them. I feel so fancy. Um, okay. So first of all, we are going to unstuff. No, I don't need anything from there, do I? Uh, from this one, I got organized, went and bought some presents. So we're taking 30 out of here. Uh, that was for the parties that my little girl had to go to. So we've still got 20, 45 in gifts, which is good. Um, I still have to work out what I'm getting my aunt for her 70th birthday. Um, my daughter had uh, her first birthday party of this weekend, yesterday, and they went and did mini golf. So that was cute. I was really hoping I'd be able to get some work done on my iPad <laughs> while she was um, doing that. But... Uh, no, she wanted me to follow her around the whole time, um, which, do you know what, is like totally fine. It's just, um, uh, what am I going to do here? <clears throat> They're only little ones, right? So my husband was like, you should have just, you should have just done your work and told her that you, you know, she had to go alone because none of the other parents like walked around with everybody. But I'm like, no, I suppose while she still wants me to be there, I really, you know, <laughs> I really want to take advantage of that because it won't be long until she's so, um, you know, till she's old enough to be like, do you know what, mum, I don't really care if you follow me around or not. <laughs> All right, so we've taken 20 out of uh, school. So that was to pay for a uh, school excursion for my youngest. Um, so I've taken out that 50 placeholder and put back in that $30. That worked well, actually. That was a bit lucky. So we've got 100 in there still, 20, 30, and 40 um, in there. So that is good. Is that right? I feel like I'm supposed to take more than that out of there. I think I'm supposed to take 30 out of there. Do you know what? I'm quite sure that I am supposed to take 30 out of there. So I'm going to take that extra 10, and if I'm wrong... Um, I'll fix that up. So we've got 120, 130 in there now. If I'm wrong, I'll put it back in when we cash off on Wednesday, but I'm pretty sure the excursion was like $28. So, uh, so we have on stuff, sorry, I already put it off to the side. We've on stuff $60 in total, 50 of that already in the bank and 10 extra. So that is that, uh, what should we do next? Let's do our buffer next. Cause we can color in. So I have cleaned this off. And we will start all over again. Um, so we have $5.97 in there to start off with. Uh, and this shouldn't take too long because we have all our big amounts back ready to go. So let's wipe out that $1. And the 99. And the other 99. 98. 98, 97, and then six cents. Beautiful. So that is a good start towards our second hundred dollars. And again, once that's finished, it'll go into our mojo. Um, unless I've already hit 500 in there, in which case I will probably put it into our bills buffer. Okay, so that is that. And then we will do our weekly check-in. Uh, so this is technically a check-in for the last week of July. Let's see how we did. Hopefully we're not finishing July all in negatives uh, like last month. <laughs> so uh, groceries, we started this week in the negative, 232. We added 800. 
we have spent 410 and 33, which means we have left 157. Um, I'm pretty happy with that. I don't think we need to do a big shop this week. I think it's just going to be a small shop. Um, so fingers crossed that will get us over the line. Uh, takeaway, we were negative 102. We added 155 from that golden paycheck. Uh, we spent 73, which is more than what we had. So we were negative 20, but we did fix that up. So petrol had 46, 76. We added 85 to that. We haven't spent anything out of that yet. Um, so we're ending on 111.24 because I've taken 20 from that and put it in there. So then this is zero. Um, cause yeah, I've just, we had a bit of extra in there. Um, so, and that was because we did extra takeaway because we had pizza for dinner to celebrate my 500 subscribers. And I also reached star seller badge status this month on Etsy, which is so awesome. Really exciting. So we had to celebrate. We could not celebrate that. The kids were, um, the kids were so excited for me. It's really cool. It's really cool to be able to do something that makes them smile. Um, be proud of their mama okay so that is everything so we had 25 in chemist we added 15 we still haven't spent anything so we have 40 that probably won't last i'll probably have to go this week because my son's got a bit of a cold so he's used up all of our um cold medicine and nasal sprays and things like that so i'm pretty sure i'm due for a for a bit of a top up okay so i should have zoomed you in for that but i will zoom you in a little bit so you can see a bit better uh, so we are starting August on a smaller income week. I do think August is actually also technically a golden month for us. It's just the smaller, so our government benefits and things are paid fortnightly. And I think we have three of those payments this month. So last month was a golden paycheck for my husband's paycheck. This month will be a golden paycheck for, yeah, that payment, which is awesome um, because I just got my car insurance renewal and I nearly died so last year i paid i think it was 939 dollars to insure my car when we changed over because we got a new car through that throughout the year and new new to us but old car um they refunded me 17 dollars. right so the insurance was cheaper for the new car than what i had paid for my previous car they refunded me 17 dollars to cover us to the same insurance date that had already been there they just got my renewal and they want one thousand three hundred and fifty six dollars yes one thousand three hundred like that is i can't even explain how and they're insuring the car for like seven thousand dollars less than the agreed value it was insured for last year so i have to make a phone call to them and just you know question their judgment a little bit um and find out if they can improve on that i've been with the same insurance company for like 20 plus years for my car um so yeah i'm hoping they'll be able to do something for me to improve that a little bit but i mean either way they're not going to be able to improve it much i'm well aware so either way we're going to be looking at well over 1200 dollars. i currently have 300 dollars <laughs> in my car insurance envelope so that puts me in a bit of a pickle so what i'm hoping to do is load up from that golden paycheck and also hopefully we can finish car alarma challenge this month and that full 250 can go towards that as well and hopefully we can cash flow it inside of this month it is going to be a bit of a struggle um but hopefully we can do it hopefully we can do it <laughs> like we'll just i'm just going to be blindly optimistic um but yeah it's just so disappointing um now i don't think we're not no nothing from there this week um so this is our this is our income for this week after i've taken rent out our variable expenses will be uh takeaway is getting 65 petrol is getting 75 and um that's because i'm due to fill up so uh chemist is getting 10 and spending is getting 20. so that is 10 each for me and hubby yay uh so that is a total of 170 
and leaves us with 510. And that whole 510 is going into our cash envelopes. So uh, our cash envelopes specifically are getting 420 and you can tune and see where that's going on Wednesday. Mini Mondays is getting 30 and our savings challenges is getting 60. Yay! So that's our 510. That leaves us with nothing. And that is our zero base budget for this week. So I imagine this has been a nice quick one uh, today. <laughs> um, I'm just thinking for my weekly check-in that I may have messed that up because I think, oh no, maybe not. Uh, no, I don't think I have. No, it's all good. Um, I wasn't sure about the petrol amount, but I think it's all good. Um, yeah, so we'll have extra in petrol, but I'm literally, I literally need to fill up like today. So um, that's why that'll be gone. And then that will be the buffer for our next fortnight. Okay, that is all for today. I feel like I'm like forgetting something, but I don't think I am. So that is all for today, you guys. Please come and join me for tomorrow. We will be doing mini Mondays. It's just a $30 week this week. So just a standard mini Mondays. Um, Hopefully we can get a challenge or two finished or at least close to finished. That would be really good. And then I will see you on Wednesday for my regular cash stuffing. Um, I will do my 500 subscriber giveaway. <laughs> so exciting. Um, on, I will announce that in my cash stuffing video on Wednesday. So I'm just working out a few little bits and pieces as to what I'm going to be giving away and um, getting those freebies made up to add to my freebies folder. So I will do that on Wednesday. So make sure you join me then for cash stuffing and giveaway announcement. All right, guys, I hope you have had a lovely weekend and I hope you have a beautiful next week. Do not forget to like, comment and of course subscribe because we will do another big giveaway I think I'll do freebies at 750 and we'll do a big giveaway at 1000. I haven't decided what it's going to be yet, but it'll be something super cool. Um, so yeah, I will see you guys tomorrow for mini Mondays. Love you. Bye.